is everyone doing i hope everyone is well welcome back to the diva caramels channel okay and today i'm here to do a bag review okay yeah so um before i do the bag review though i want to say hello to all my new subscribers hi guys i had a few subscribers recently so i just want to welcome you guys to my channel and hello also to all my old subscribers thanks for sticking around and i hope you too are enjoying my channel as well okay yeah so I'm here to do this bag review okay so I first saw this bag well I don't say first saw it but I was most intrigued by it when I when I saw a lady that I'm subscribed to I think her name is Trainsetter 83 okay and she did a what's in my bag and she had this particular bag and this particular color and I liked it a lot and I did some research and I did some reviews and I check out the chat the on the channel they check out the sites and stuff like that and yes yeah, so I got that bag and I was also looking on here for reviews and stuff but I didn't see many that I had really gotten like enough information from yes yeah, so I just wanted to come and do a review and give you some specs on it that if you are interested in purchasing this bag you would be better able to see it and hear about it and and I will give you the specs on it and stuff like that okay yeah so I got the well may have you got for me the furla candy bag okay so this is the bag it comes in it's like a satiny type of white material and the writing obviously is in black furla okay so the color I got was the dragon fruit color okay it's a really nice color um, online is kind of tricky when you're trying to get the colors but I thought it was a lighter pink but it's a, like a darker pink so it's more like a fuchsia to me it's more like a fuchsia pink okay more so than like a neon pink or whatever yeah so and it's supposed to be well it is see-through but it's not like like totally see-through so I like that about it the they have others other colors i think the white and orange but they have different names for them they're not like just white and orange they have like bomb bomb and ocean blue and stuff like that but if you check out www.ferla.com you will see the colors and put in candy bag or candy satchel and also on amazon and zappos and macy's they have they're on quite a few sites because they were popular um they are popular bikes I guess and I only recently got my hands on one okay so I just wanted to share it with you guys and give you some specs on it okay so yes it is a plastic but it's not a cheapy like plastic it's a very nice hard quality plastic okay it people were complaining about the smell and yes it does have a smell so I'm hoping I'm hoping that with time the smell goes away it's not like too overwhelming though if you you have to put your nose like really close up to it to to smell it okay so yeah it came nicely packaged in that bag and the hardware on it is gold it has this gold furla lock with an f on it and at the back it has furla made in italy yeah made in italy okay it has the a little tab here with the gold furla written here hope you can see it the zipper is gold and I read some reviews and people were saying that the the zip was giving them some trouble but this is not this is zipping really good it's not sticking it on me or anything like that okay the handles are sturdy so if you put the bag is already heavy but the handles are sturdy that if you put more weight in the bag you know you I don't think you will have a problem of the handles popping or anything like that um, I think I saw someone spoke about it tearing from the zip so I guess it will try to limit the amount of stuff you put in the bag because it's already heavy as it is okay it came with this candy bag tag it comes in the bag wrapped okay and it does say for a candy bag made in Italy okay it has for written right here 
on both sides okay and it's not like hard it's move you it can move so you know it's not like a stiff plastic is it has movement okay so you can put stuff in it and this is it well plenty space is not like huge but you can fit things into it I just put a couple things in it so you guys can see that it can it holds stuff and it still has a lot of room okay so I just have my purse in here my sunglasses in here and just a small makeup bag just to you know give it a little shape and let you guys see that it can hold stuff and it still has a lot of room okay it has five feet yeah and the, the lock doesn't have a key it is just a spring and you just pull it and it will come off and you can lock the bag but I don't think it will make sense because it doesn't have a key that you can unlock so anybody can still get in it just pull it and it would undo okay so this is the dragon fruit color as I said and the the length on it was they say the handle the drop of the handle is six inches but the full length of it is 14 the width of it is on the side on the fur let's say it says 11 and 3 quarters but when it measured got like 12 okay and then the the height is 8 inches on there it says 8 inches as well and when it measured it said 8 inches and and the width across this way is, uh, is 7 when it measured it is 7 but on the side it says 6 and 3 quarters so it's a good size by So there's just a closer look of it. It's a really nice bag. I really like it. A lot of people were saying it's a statement piece that wherever they take it, they always had persons asking them um, where they got it and complimenting them on it and stuff. I haven't, I haven't worn it as yet, but from the color and everything, it's just different. So um, I know persons is like eye catching. So yeah. <laughs> it is really a statement piece okay so i just wanted to come and do that review for you guys and show you and show you some specs on it and i hope that if you're if you were looking at this bag that that helped you in some way and i if i would recommend it hell yes i would recommend it okay and a story behind this bag okay so i when i first saw the bag i went on furla.com okay and it was like 248 us and i was like oh my gosh 248 us for a plastic bag but i was like it's so cutesy and it's so different you know so like i said well i guess it's worth it and when i saw the reviews person was saying it's even better in person the is it's a good bag is the material is sturdy and i can attest to that it really is but it was still saying 248 mm, i'm not sure but when i I then went on Amazon and I was eyeing it there on Amazon. They had mixed reviews there on Amazon as well, but mostly good reviews. And then I happened to find a 20% off code. So I was like, okay, that's good. I, this is my time now to, to get the bag. So I used the 20% off code and I got it for 216 US. Okay. And yes, yeah, so I went ahead and I purchased the bag. Anyhow, like two days after, you know, like I'm with a person, I will buy something and they will still go and be eyeing it online or whatever. So, like two days or so after, I go on Amazon and they check in on this bike and I see the bike for 133 US. And I'm like, what the be? Seriously? I just purchased this bike for 216 US. I know it's for 133 US in less than a week. So, I was like really annoyed so I was like okay I'm gonna message email or send a message to customer service and let them know I'm not pleased at all that I just purchased this bag and is now discounted to 133 US and I, and I would ask them if I can kindly get refunded on the difference you know so I was thinking that they would send back and give me a whole lot of story you know cuz I'm in Barbados and 
purchasing things here and stuff is kind of it's not as easy as you guys i hear you guys say oh i take back stuff you guys in the states i take back stuff after like weeks and here mm -mm, not in barbados it ain't so easy okay so i was looking for them to give me some excuse as to why they can't refund me the money but instead they sent me back and the shirt said same thing it was the same day that i messaged they sent back and said Yes, they realized that I only purchased it a couple of days ago and it is showing um, the discounted price and they would refund me the difference. And I was like, no way. That easy? I was like, so surprised, you know? So I was like, I can't believe it. It was like, I saved the email because I said these people just saying so, you know, to hush me up or whatever. But, I, but then in like two days or so, they sent back and said the the money has been refunded to my card and I was like super pleased and I was like I can't believe it and I was so happy so in all between the 20% discount and the 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 discount further discount on um, when I saw it the two days after I actually paid like 105 US for this bike yep 105 us for my little baby you know what i'm saying so you know that i was like i'm a amazon customer for life <laughs> i was so pleased i had to send back and give them a really good review because really and truly customer service was like i mean no problem and they say you would receive it in x more days or receive it in that in the days they stated the tracking you could track it they had all the information there for you to see every time you check or whatever the progress of it and stuff like that and yeah all in all it was like really happy with Amazon I, I like that site and after this purchase it was like yep they get a, a 10 out of 10 from me okay so yeah so that's my little story about my bike <laughs> after seeing it for so much money and stuff and like wasn't was hesitant and stuff i still end up getting a really good deal on it so yeah so all the more i'm even happier okay if i would pay the 248 i think i would have still paid the 248 if i didn't find a discount code or if i didn't find it at or if i didn't get the free discount i think i would have still bought it you know and say well hey it's for me as a splurge but getting it at even cheaper price was like excellent so yeah that's just my review on my new baby and i hope you guys like the review and i hope if you are thinking about it yes get it it's super cute they have so many colors you can choose from and it's a statement piece it's a quality bag and i would recommend it to all my divas out there that you know are interested go ahead get it for yourself give yourself a little um treat for christmas or whatever christmas coming or whatever yeah give yourself a little treat so thanks for watching sweeties i hope you enjoyed the video and if you do thumbs up this video yeah and leave your comments and stuff if you have the bag if you're interested in getting the bag any questions just leave them in the comment section and i'll get back to you okay sweeties thanks and i'll see you on my other video bye